Hello, I'm Tristan. Amazon just announced a major upgrade to Amazon Music. Instead of having access to 2 million songs as part of Amazon Music, you now get over 100 million songs. Wow. But there's a catch, and it all boils down to three magical words in shuffle mode. Previously, without an Amazon Music Unlimited subscription, you could ask your Echo to play a certain song or artist. If that was part of the 2 million songs included with Prime Music, it would play it. Now, however, it just won't do that. Shuffle mode means that Prime Music is now Spotify free. When you ask for a song, it will play a similar playlist instead. And if you're really lucky, that playlist might include the song you actually asked for. Yesterday, my wife asked our Echo Show to play Billy Ocean songs. Previously, this would have played a handful of songs without issue, but now it plays random artists as part of the shuffle mode. Play songs by Billy Ocean. Shuffling Billy Ocean and similar artists on Amazon Music. They actually rickrolled me. This upgrade has also broken loads of my own Alexa routines. For example, we have a bedtime routine that plays a specific song, one that I actually purchased the MP3 for, in fact. But Amazon now refuses to play the song, instead playing some deep sleep playlists as part of the shuffle mode. Gee, thanks, Amazon. <sighs> Now, it's possible that the, some of these are actually bugs that Amazon will iron out, but I doubt things will improve much. Amazon clearly wants to push you to pay for a music unlimited subscription. If that wasn't the case, then, you know, they wouldn't have spent months actually developing this new feature, all centering around shuffle mode. Taking away a bunch of features is an intentional strategy from Amazon, in my opinion. So what alternatives do you have without paying for a music subscription? Well, not many. Google, as part of Google Home, broke their free music features a couple of years ago as part of their YouTube premium rollout. You can try buying individual MP3s to play on your Echo, and a helpful Reddit thread shows you how you can sort of play these songs, but this feature is quite hit and miss. I've also tried creating loads of little playlists with one or two songs, but Amazon then just fills them up with irrelevant songs when you try playing that playlist. To wrap up, Amazon seems to have intentionally taken away some really basic features from Prime Music, which sucks. I refuse to pay for a music subscription, so I'm quite frustrated by this upgrade. I will keep an eye on workarounds and bug fixes and put a pinned comment with anything I find. Until then, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please click the like button if you did. Please also leave a comment with your thoughts on this upgrade by Amazon and feel free to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.